Well, the has first part is too sophisticated a term for me. But, um, <laughs> but, but has it worked yes, out? Yes, it has worked out. On every major decision, the president has actually sought my advice. Joe Biden's doing an outstanding job. Working the president wants Canada. everyone to know, his team and us, Hello. in case there's any question, that he thinks he made a brilliant choice. He's pretty fearless in offering his opinions. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, he's oftentimes willing to, to make the contrarian argument and really forces people to think and defend their positions. Uh, and that ends up being very valuable for me. Does he argue with you? Uh, you know, uh, uh, Joe's not uh, afraid to tell me what he thinks. And that's exactly what I need and exactly what I want. And that's why I've asked Vice President Biden to lead a tough, unprecedented oversight effort. Because nobody messes with Joe. With so much on his plate, the president has made his number two the stimulus cop. The assignment, to see that the $787 billion in stimulus money is spent wisely. You cannot take that money and, you know, put it in a rainy day fund or whatever. He's on the phone several hours a week with mayors and governors, making sure they follow the rules. But don't come back and tell me you build a swimming pool because it doesn't pass the smell test. It does seem like the administration is saying, we can do it all. The spending, not have taxes, all of that. Maybe you're not completely leveling with us, that your assumptions are too rosy. This was just what the administration yeah. was not supposed to be doing. What we have done is we have taken what are the consensus estimates on the low side of what we think is going to happen. But I keep hearing that we're going to have high, really high unemployment well, till the end of 2010. Look, it took us a long time to get into this. And it's going to take us a while to 